What's going on everybody? So today I'm going to talk to you about what it's like to be gay. So I feel so much better being able to like share who I am now with all my friends really and people that I used to work with or people that I went to school with. It was important for me to have people see me as this smart, intelligent, caring, giving, forgiving person, rather than just that gay kid. Coming out is a very big deal in any gay person's life, because you're sharing who you really are with the rest of the world, and for some people talking about that stuff just isn't easy for them, and if you have friends that you suspect are gay, you really shouldn't push them towards this. Like, they will come out when they are ready. If you're like me, you're afraid that people aren't going to accept you for who you are, like they might resent you, um, your relationships with people might change, and you just want to avoid that whenever possible. I understand that. I mean, that's why I waited so long too. It took me a while to figure out myself and who I was as a person, what I wanted to be, what I am now. When it comes to me, I'd say I had it really lucky because though I wasn't ready for it at the time, I certainly am now, and just having this time to process everything that's happened, slowly come out to people whenever you're ready, is just an, a remarkable thing. Homosexuality is a very rough lifestyle. I mean, it's obviously not as bad as it was then compared to how it is now, because like I said, I had a very lucky and fortunate coming out experience. Like, just about all my friends were very accepting of who I was. They were always telling me, oh, I'm so proud of you. Like. Congratulations, I'll always support you. And hearing that from people made me feel so good. I only hope that everyone else can be like that. Um, there are, however, people that aren't as forgiving about that. Like some people are really against homosexuality and I get that, but really, like, like what? Like it doesn't affect you in any way. So I don't understand why people are so against it. Like doesn't matter. Growing up as a child, I was into girls early on, but then something changed. It was around middle school, around the time about sixth grade-ish, around then. That's when I started to look into guys the same way that I looked into other girls. And over time, it took me a while to accept the fact that I might be into men. And as I said again, like, it took me a while to admit it to myself, and it was important for me to admit it to myself before I could come out and tell other people. In the past, throughout high school, middle school, all school really, I had crushes, relationships like I told you, and if we dated and you're watching this now, lol. Every time someone asked me, are you gay? Dude, no offense, but are you gay? I always think to myself, I know where this is going. But each time they asked me, I never was really shocked. On one hand, I had the option of telling them, yes, I am gay, and hoping that they will accept me for who I am as a person and how I choose to spend my life, and hope that they will not tell my secret, at least until I'm ready. Or on the other hand, no, I'm not, and just move on from that. Back then, that seemed like the right course of action. Um, I put on this face every day that wasn't who I was, and lately, it just didn't feel right to do that anymore. Day one, I told a friend of mine, and he didn't take it well. And later that night, I had told some of my other best friends, and they were extremely supportive. They were so proud of me for coming out. They were super encouraging. Then over time, I realized that if I'm going to tell my friends, I should be telling my family too. I was extremely emotional when I started telling people. Cause like I said, like I wasn't prepared for this. Um, I'd say I was kind of forced to. I didn't want to live a life knowing I was someone that I wasn't. And I wanted people to be able to see the real me. The more people I told, I always heard mixed people's reactions. I always heard, oh, that's so great for you. I'm proud of you. You do you, all that. I don't really care. It's your lifestyle. You do you. And I'm completely against that. This isn't going to work out. 
And when I realized that some of my friends at the time were not going to accept me for who I was, I realized that right then and there, this was not going to work out. And if I was ever going to be able to like explore myself some more, I had to cut them off. And it felt really good. I mean, yeah, I knew these people for a while and I consider them really close friends, but if they were really my close friends and they'd understand this and be happy for me, which some of them weren't. And that's just how it is. I know now that because my little secret is out that I'm going to face discrimination and people are not going to be very accepting of this, but that's who I am and I'm prepared to face that now because I feel confident enough in myself to be able to go out, go to the store, go for a walk, go for a jog, whatever it may be, and just be happy knowing that I can finally tell people who I am. And finally, please. If people are not going to accept you, then do not surround yourself with them. Like I know already which friends of mine will accept me, which friends of mine won't, and who could go either way? Making this video has been a lot of fun, so I can't wait to make more. I've already got some more scripts on the works. Um, just waiting for some new equipment to come in and we'll go from there.